Today pretty big waves, but we managed to do two dives today. Uh, one dive, Gemma look, another one, Pyramids. The most challenging actually was just to get into the boot and to come out. As long you swim a little bit away from the shore, the visibility, and as long you get below one, one and a half meters, the surface layer, the visibility was actually good. Guys were super excited, super positive. It's always a pleasure to dive with such positive people. Yesterday, Hagong, today, diving. What are we gonna do tomorrow? No one knows. We'll see. Do we have some divers coming around?
like I said in yesterday's episode, I started hiking about midnight and I was on a top already at 4 a.m. And when I, when I was climbing up, I was like, I felt it's really steep, the place where I, I, I'm climbing up. I mean, when I came close to the summit. But since I wasn't able to see around, so then I was like, okay, looks like this is a, this is a trail. So finally, when I got on the top, in that place, uh, it's really narrow. So the slope and next is uh, the, the beginning of the crater of the volcano. And it was so dark and I was able only see that this is the edge and there is a crater. So it's, it's dark and even with uh, my head torch, I wasn't able to see anything. I was able to see that I cannot go down because it's too steep and if I will slide I will I will not be able I will not be able to stop. Then on the right side it was also dark so it means it's a cliff. On the left side also cliff. And I was like up and I was sitting on this on this narrow edge and I was like thinking shit how I'm going to get down on this one. And then it was 4 a.m. It's two hours to wait until it will be uh, it will be the sunrise and I will be able to see something. So uh, I understood that I cannot sit there for two hours because first of all in that place it was windy, 12 degrees, really cold. So I decided to, while sitting, move a little bit to the left uh, in some direction. And finally I reached the place where I was able to put my feet on and finally I was I got into the corner where I was able to sit, but then again, uh, to take something out of the of my bag, it was really risky because in a place where I was sitting was really steep, so I wasn't able to move. Like I was like put the bag in a corner, I made sure it's not sliding somewhere down. So then I took out the wood, then I took the out of out the kettle where uh, I usually boil the wood for the coffee and that's that's the thing and, and that i stayed in that place until the sunrise and when there was a sunrise that everything was clear uh, where i can go where i cannot go interesting story today minister of health announced that bali is uh, number one in numbers when we're comparing how many percent of the people wearing masks so we are number one what it means uh how accurate is this numbers no one really knows, but it means that someone is pushing through opening of Bali. And that's good. I'm, I'm happy about this news. Let's wait for the result. All right, that's it for today. Thank you very much for watching again. Subscribe, follow on Instagram and Facebook, and see you tomorrow again. Bye.